Hey guys, this time I just want to share with you another GIMP tutorial. And again, GIMP is a freeware program very much like Photoshop. So if you would recall, I had made a video about turning yourself into a vampire, which basically includes um, changing the eye color and altering the teeth. So this time I'm just going to share with you a cool set of brushes you can install with GIMP. And the idea came from one of my viewers who had... Um, place a comment on this particular video it says here okay I'm just going to read a part of it so it says here from pinks uh, biggest fan 92 <laughs> it says here it would be great though if you show how to do blood under teeth so I'm just going to share with you a cool brush or a set of brushes that I had found from deviant art basically allows you to do that. So let's begin. This is where I downloaded uh, the bloody brushes and it's made by Lady Ryan and this is from DeviantArt. So we have a set of brushes we can use with GIMP. So if you download it, you'll receive a zip file. So unzip it, read the readme uh, text and you'll receive this particular folder. So open it, just unzip it um, to your desktop or wherever you want, and then copy this, so you have to select all, okay, and then copy, copy, so we go to wherever your GIMP is, so in my case it's in C, so I'm just going to go with GIMP, GIMP, then share, then GIMP, then 2.0, then brushes, and then you paste all your brushes, yes to all, and there you go, you're ready to use them. So I'm just going to close this, I'm going to open GIMP. So restart GIMP to be able to use your brushes. And then, if you go to your brushes, you will have your own blood brush. So, like so. Oops. Like so. So, I'm just going to change this to red. Bloody red. And there's your blood. Very, very easy <laughs> and fun way to do. If you just want to have stain on wherever, you know. It's a really cool way of doing it having your own bloody brushes so it's really simple really easy to do and i'm really psyched about it so here i go i just want to share this with you guys okay okay suppose you have a picture of edward cullen here so i'm just going to choose uh, brush 22 i'm just going to put some blood in his face so other brushes, let's say this one, put it anywhere we want. So it's really up to you guys and how you would want your images to look like. So I think it's pretty cool. And also I have some here. <laughs> so there you go. These are called Bloody Brushes, again by Lady Orion, and they're free to download. So it's a pretty cool um, set of brushes to have with GIMP. Okay, so this is just a quick video about it. If you have any question about my videos or other things related, please message me here on YouTube and I'll get to them as soon as I can. And to all my subscribers, I really appreciate it, guys. If you have any requests, please message me here on YouTube and, well, as soon as possible, I'll make them. So just watch out for those, alright? So I'm just going to try another brush before I close this video. This one's pretty big. Let's say in the shirt. <laughs> okay. And another one. It's, it's pretty um, interesting to do, actually. You have a lot of uh, style there to choose from. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> anyway, it looks like stickers now. So it really depends on you guys with how you would want your image to look like. Anyway, this or cool brushes free to download and again 
please do check out my YouTube partners they're on my channel and um, also my other videos there so again thanks for watching this video and as always just have fun see you guys